Hello everyone, this is Hugo from Ichiban Painting and this is a little showcase. We have a uh, Eldar Ultran, Ultran, Ultran. I really don't know how you pronounce that. Uh, so here we have him. Um, basically the client actually, uh, this is a tabletop level <laughs> miniature. Uh, so basically the client asked me to do a tabletop job on him and another of his buddy, uh, this guy. It's not finished yet, still a work in progress. And um, his Wood Elf, so it's the same commission from the Wood Elf. So basically, uh, I tried to match his color scheme on there, so he had some gold in his color scheme with blue and white, and his base were snow. So basically, that's what I tried to, uh, to replicate with this guy. Um, so a little bit of uh, blue tones in the, the shadow for his cloak in the back. Um, I tried to do some quick uh, true metallic metal for uh, the sword and the gold parts. I think that the gold staff turned out amazingly good for the amount of time that I spent on it. I did the rune freehand, uh, not you know they're 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 okay. They're not crazy, uh, super nice. You can see that the mall is still a little bit bent. That's the fine cast. I didn't uh, unbent it. I'll leave that to my client. Don't want to break the model, and yep, yeah, that's pretty much it. This guy comes in on a custom base and a custom display base. So basically, the custom base you can take the middle base, and he's still on a 25 mil base. And even with the other guy, he still fits there. So they both fit uh, really well on that display base. So whether or not my client wants to decide, he wants. Uh, one or the other display then you can choose which one you want and just slapping him on the base and, and just a little cool addition uh, that I've done so basically that's it let's just go look at him in uh, zoom oh, I'll turn him back again just let's zoom in sorry the camera is gonna move weirdly I just want to zoom in on the staff look at this it's pretty nice I think for what's technically uh, supposed to be a, a tabletop standard, it's pretty nice, I think. Um, even you know, I create, I did the shadows here. You can see on his, uh, I don't know what you would call it, his armor part. There's some darker blue and lighter blue. Same thing for there. It's not a light trick. It it, it is done with the paint. So. I tried to do the same kind of, uh, of effect that I would normally do on a model that I make myself uh, that I paint to a higher standard but tried to keep the techniques a little bit faster and more uh, you know less precise if you would say uh, but basically that's it so if you're looking at the cloak in the back it still looks really nice but when you zoom in it's, an, it's a little bit rougher than normally uh, my normal stuff my normal quality you would zoom in and you would or at least I try to make it as smooth as possible on this one you can see the transition are not as smooth as a higher hand quality but as you know it, you can still look at it from pretty close and it's pretty you know bang on and really nice the gems are all uh, glazed and to make them look like real gems and everything so yeah that's pretty much it a couple of people ask me I'm, I'm gonna, uh, how many time I spent on that mall and I would say probably like four hours uh, or something like that around that so basically that's pretty much it this was Hugo from Ichiban Painting and I'll see you guys on the next video cheers for watching